Hi guys, in this presentation, we shall learn about bit shifting in negative numbers. So, bit shifting in negative numbers is somewhat interesting rather than positive numbers. So, let's see here, you can see minus 2. Minus 2's binary value is 1111 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 0. Okay, it is nothing but it is stored in 2's complement form. If you have any doubt regarding this 2's complement form or negative numbers, then you can check out my previous videos. First of all, what happens? Minus 2 left shift with one time. What is my answer? Let's see. You can see that if I left shift it, then this is out of the box. Okay. And since this is out of the box, these values are come here. Okay. Let's see how. 1, 1, 1. These three ones are here. And this one will be here. And here. 1 1 0 since 1 is out of the box here here 1 is 1 place is vacant okay in that vacant place we have to put 0 so this is the answer so this is after first shift okay what happens if I do this another time means second shift let's see what happens again I can write simply like 1 1 1 1 1 0 0 0 okay this is second shift and so on okay i'll do up to eight shifts and we'll see what happens okay you can easily say that if i shift minus two left left first one time then your answer will be here minus four okay here your answer is minus eight okay this is continuous but is it true for all all the shifts or all the numbers let's check out with a program okay you can see that here there's a small code the explanation of code is the out of the scope of this lecture but what I am doing is see here there is a number see number 1 is a variable there in that I have stored minus 2 and I am shifting from 0 to 7 times which means I am shifting first number with 0 shifts left shift and then 1 left shift 2 3 4 and so on up to 7 shifts okay and we will see the values how exactly it comes and we can analysis it okay let's see you can see that first answer is minus two second answer is minus four third answer is minus eight which means this is this is zero shift first shift second shift third shift like this okay you can see some pattern like into two into two into two into two like so you might think that if negative numbers are shifted left then it is nothing but multiplication with two then you can see here the answer is zero what's my conclusion is that there is no fixed rule that it should be applicable okay now if you see minus 77 if i shift one time left to it then what is my answer this is the answer if i shift it okay one time one time to the left side okay we are working with left shift okay now observe something here here this one represents negative number now it became zero here so it became positive so by by seeing this only we can say that there is no rigorous method or there is no particular method to to calculate its value unless we have to shift it like this mechanical way rather than using that formula like two power shift times into our division whatever the whatever the shift is okay you can see that here the value is minus 77 which I have stored in this variable called num num1 and I'll compile it and I'll run it we'll see what happens okay you can see that here first number is minus 77 it is okay because the shift is 0 if I shift one time it became a positive number and that to 102 okay again if I shift it negative number negative number positive number positive number negative number see there is we can't predict the value okay we, we we have to do the shifts and we have to calculate it calculate it manually okay so this is the main drawback in negative numbers okay in negative numbers we have to do it okay you might ask so what happens in this case in this case it's working right somehow it's working minus 2 minus 4 minus 8 minus 16 minus 32 minus 2 the reason is see here all ones are there here all ones are there if I shift this left side by one time then here 
zero will be added and here one is there so from here to here it is a negative number so somehow it's working right whenever the number became like this see whenever see here the zero came right whenever this zero is left shifted which means this one is overwritten zero one 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 zero 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 one 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 and here extra zero will be there then it became positive number so what's my conclusion is whenever you get a negative number which we have to shift it left time then we have to do it manually okay there is no uh, ready-made formula to find the value if i consider minus 25 minus 25 binary value is this so after shifting now we are interested in right shift okay now after shifting right side with shift one which means i have to shift these bits one time to the right then what is my expected value so you might think like this if i shift this right then i'll get answer as okay see if i shift this number one time to the right then this will be out of this box and since out of this box this number come here it's like one 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 zero zero one one since one is out of this box here one space will be there so zero so you might think this is the answer okay but this is a wrong approach okay in this type of conditions here this msp bit is fixed or you can say preserved okay so what exactly i mean let's see with an example so this is what my answer if i do with normal approach okay so what happens exactly now if i shift this right times by one so here is my approach this will be out of this box okay and this one come from here to here this place okay this place and this one come from here to here one this zero here this zero here this one here this one here this one here now here is a crucial point what i said is it is fixed which means while shifting it will copy copy the value not give the value for example see if if i shift it one time to the right then here place is vacant right in this case it is not like that okay this one is fixed here it might give a copy of that but it will not give the exact value which means what i what i mean to say is here the answer here the value will be one but not zero unless you can see in this case here the value is zero but here the value is one so what's its value okay we'll see in a program and we'll we will get some conclusions from there okay now we can see that minus 25 is i have stored in this variable and we'll see what happens if i shifted it to right right shift right see i have to shift the number right shift okay okay you can see that except this value this this last one these are copied from here to here okay now see actually we have to get the answer as zero here but the value is one it is due to this msb bit is preserved okay it it will copy it will not move okay in simple words now this value is minus 13 again if i shift it minus 7 shift it minus 4 minus 2 minus 1 minus 1 minus 1 now you can see something here in previous condition where i shift left shift then you can see that the answer is fluctuating between minus and plus okay it depends on the number it depends on the shift okay various parameters it depends but in this case no matter how many shifts we do the answer is in negative only okay so this is our first observation and you can observe something here you can see that if i shift minus 25 left shift then i can see that your answer is 13 okay i'll 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 do this minus 25 13 7 right here the answer is minus 13 okay so your question is minus 25 the first number is minus 25 if i divide it by 2 then i'll get as so 12 as quotient you can see that the difference is 1 okay neglect this sign okay if i 
take this 13 okay and divide it by 2 minus 6 which means you can observe something here so if I divide this original number by 2 I got the minus 12 as the answer but the actual answer is minus 13 okay if I divide it by 2 again the answer is minus 6 but the actual answer is 7 you can you can see in that window I'll, I'll show you see here minus 13 is minus 7 it's divisible by 2 and we have to add 1 to it okay to the to this number okay now what happens if I shift right time right shift by one time okay if I do this shift one time then this will be out of the box and this will come below like see so, since we know that last position will be filled with one only due to bit preservance okay due to due to this MSB one here we know that MSB will just copy but not move okay then we can replace one here so here is the answer if you find this values is minus 13 so I can see if I shift it one time to the right if I divide it by 2 then I'll get as minus 13 here we have to add it here we have to don't add it so how can we generalize it you can see some of the observations here here these are odd numbers okay but here these are even numbers so for even numbers this will work okay for odd numbers we have to add one to it okay let's see with an example and we'll conclude the topic yes i stored minus 26 in the value in that variable you can see that minus 26 minus 26 by 2 is minus 13 minus 13 is the answer see you can check out here since minus 13 is an odd number we have to divide it by 2 and add 1 to it 13 by 2 is 6 6 plus 1 is 7 see again 7 is odd number 7 by 2 is 3 3 plus 1 is 4 so this is how it works okay you can, all i have already said that at some condition okay see after this see after this shift this here the value will be 1 okay in this condition all the values are minus 1 so what is the conclusion is whenever you get a negative number okay we have we have two choices either to left shift or to right shift okay so i highly recommend do it manually so whenever i got right shift then we have to see whether the number is a even number or an odd number okay if it is an even number then divide the number by 2 take the quotient this is the answer okay if it is an odd number then divide it by 2 and add 1 to it okay this is the answer okay now here in division remember for, for suppose if i have minus 13 by 2 now your answer will be uh, 6 to 12 right minus 6 add 1 to it which means minus 7 okay what what i mean is add directly to this value not don't consider here sign okay or else you can do like directly write minus 1 then you can include this sign also okay minus 7 okay so this is the conclusion for the negative numbers in bit shifting okay